Great here. Welcome back to Factorio. Ah, look at that. We're capped out on accumulator charge. Our engines are actually uh, dropping off. So now they're storing up hot water for the extra engines. I would still like to see them completely shut off. Let's take a look at our... Yeah, we still have tons of solar panels that need to be placed. Well, maybe, maybe not. Let's get this, get that in there so we don't have to worry about the batteries in here. Uh, let's see, what do I want to do today? Ooh, I see something that I can do. Let's head out here, and let's get my logistics wall there. And how far out can I go, do you think? Can I get this coal? Dare I get the coal? No. No, 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 no. I will go here. You know, it would help if I'm on the inside of the wall. Just saying. And... There. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to get rid of all of this right here. And I don't... Yeah, I got wall on me, so... There we go. This wonderful giant area where I can put more solar panels. Yeah, I still have more solar panels over here that I have to place. And why is that blinking? Oh god. I hope that entire field is is hooked up. Where's my Blueprint. There we go. Let's go over there and take a look and see what happened. You can't catch me, Kappa. Okay, they are catching me. Let's cross the tracks. I misplaced by exactly one. And that caused this entire field not to be hooked up, I bet you. 192. Oh, this entire field's not hooked up at all. Really? Wow. I would have thought it was hooked up up here somewhere. And this entire field over here is not hooked up either. Because I'm off by one. <laughs> well, that was silly. These are... not going to be hooked in ever. So that's a bunch more accumulator charge. And a bunch more solar panels. There we go. I feel silly, so silly. So what is our... Are we still on the way up? No, we're capped out. But our accumulator is charging. Yeah, look, look at that jump right there between here, that peak, and this peak. That's what happens when you mess up just a little bit. Wow. 
Now, I'm pretty sure for the past little bit, people have been probably yelling at the screen, going, why aren't you using efficiency modules? And the answer is pretty easy. Um, efficiency modules uh, aren't worth the cost. Um, if, if you plan on playing a campaign long term, yeah, uh, they, they may help out. Or if you're going for reduction of, of power and stuff. But remember, I have a plastic sort shortage right now. And the plastic is what's limiting me here on these speed modules and the red circuits for my, my blue circuits. Which is what I need to make all of these. Now, if I were to make efficiency modules, those would require plastic and red, uh, red circuits. So I would be cutting, uh, cutting into my production over there. I'm up to 1.8, so I, yeah, I'm burning through my light oil now. So, uh, the solar panels are just steel, electronic circuits, and copper. All stuff I have in, in abundance. The accumulators are iron plates and batteries. Well, you, you see how little the sulfur over here is draining out of... I mean, I've, I've got this much sulfur. It takes six gas. I, the, the sulfur is, I'm not hurting for sulfur is what I'm trying to say. So this drain right here isn't that great. So the accumulators are still cheaper than creating the efficiency modules. Yeah, the efficiency modules would help, but eh, I, I, I'm trying to get this done as quickly as possible. So, going for the cheaper... Oh, I hope this grid is plugged in. I bet you it's not. No, it is right there. Going for the, for the cheaper uh, further generation of more power. That, uh, and saving the petroleum products for the actual robot. That helps. So, let's go to the 10 minute... That's nice to... Why are we having fluctuations there? That's weird. That should be a steady... Well, actually, let me look at that again. Ten minutes. Oh, it's when I have zero down here on the engines. Nice. Which means I might actually have... How has that belt been there, huh? Wow. Okay, let's get this. There we go. That's good enough for now. Oop. I might have to tap into another another coal vein here pretty soon. In fact, how's my coal doing? Or not coal, copper vein. 182, so I've gained a thousand coal since I last looked. Right, I wanted to check the hot water. I've got plenty of hot water. Nice. So that means I should have full engine throughput throughout the night. Uh, let's see. So there's the accumulators. There's the engines dropping off to... Are these all still running at max? Yeah, looks like it. Okay. Oof. Yeah, my copper production is definitely on the decline. Well, yeah, this capper, capper, copper field is tapped out, is what I was trying to say.
Okay. So. I do have one quite. What was I thinking here? I do have a copper injection. Okay. So, let's see what it's going to take to get this copper up there. You know what? I don't think it's going to be that bad. I'm stuck on something. You don't need to be here anymore. Where are they? They're up here somewhere. Oh, it's so much nicer running around here with all of this concrete. There they are. There we go. Why are you bringing me ammo? What? I, I don't want ammo anymore. None. Thank you. Okay. That was weird. How long have I had that in place? Yeah, my copper production's a problem now. Well, here's the next problem to solve while, think, uh, while distracting me from the counter. Where's my copper? There it is. So, let's get... And... Why am I not requesting these? Let's blueprint this. No, not yet. Let's actually get it fully extended out to there and there. There. That's what I want to blueprint out. So, there. There. And there. Good deal. So now let's just run all the way up. And same thing here, all the way up. Good. Where's... and more redundant links into the solar array. I approve. Oh, no. Oh, I just need to move this one up one. Got it. Like so. You know what? I want... Not that. Let's go from here 
to there. And let's put that blueprint in there and create another one. Now we need to get copper up there. Let's build it backwards. In fact, we'll just build it off of this. Nope. There. And in fact, this can now go into there. There we go. So I don't want to have to go over this line anymore. Not needed. Not needed. Wow, wooden poles. Seems like forever ago that I had those wooden poles dropped. In fact, I think that was my original line, because those are right, right up against the belt. Nice. And in fact, now that I've got this cleared out, I can cut the line right there. And I can repurpose this. for the copper. Reverse that. There we go. Let's squeak through here. Now where's my copper? It's all the way over there. And to there. And this. Yep, that's good enough. There. You know what? No, I don't want to do this. I do not want to do that. What I want to do is I'm going to run these all the way over to here. To there. Now let's chop this. And I think I still have it in my blueprint book. There it is. And now let's have that go out there. Now let's help this along, like so. You know what? I want this to be there. Because I'm going to have this loop back around. Like so. Okay, so there's a full, a mostly full line of red belt. Uh, maybe I shouldn't have this. Eh, kind of defeats the purpose. 
It's, it's only a couple copper that's just going to be hanging there. You are no longer needed. So let's take a look at the copper production now. Nice. Is this all the way down? Yes, it is. Wow, that could be helpful. Oh, this one doesn't have anything left. Well, it's a good thing that I uh, got that in there, isn't it? Okay. Let's take a look at our copper production down on the bus again. Still kind of tepid. However, we do have that, which we can put right there. Really, I don't have the... Oh, no, I do. Here they come. go. Wow, it's dark in here. Come on. There. So... There we go. So that's all running nice and dandy. We now have another line of smelting. And let's merge it in properly. Like so. And now we should have one solid line of copper. You know what I'm going to do though? I ran it down there because I was worried about the concrete. Well, I'm not worried about the concrete anymore. So let's do this. There. No, I don't have two full lines of copper, but I had more than one. So now, I will definitely be getting more copper down the length of the bus. Now let's look at our stats for 10 minutes. That is glorious. Look at that. Made it through the night without a problem. Okay, we're doing better. In fact, how does our... Nah. Our crude is getting a bit low, but... I'm not going to say that we're, we've got a stock, but look at that. We're getting 
kind of regular deliveries. I'm definitely... Not all of them are running, but most of them are. We're down to 1.5k here. Plastic is... Backing up. Hmm. Okay, well, I'm not going to complain. Red circuits are going. Let's go take a look. Wow, how much more? Are we done with the concrete? Really? Aw. 94%. Holy, what's, what's the holdup here? What's the holdup? What's the holdup? Rocket fuel. It's the rocket fuel. Okay, so we got this balanced out a bit better. Let's take a look. Come on. So close. more. Speed there, speed there. Now, is this enough? Maybe not. So, one more chemical you all can go away. One more chemical plant. Where's my chemical plant? There it is. Yeah, it's definitely not enough. Where's my chemical plant? why I had water because I yeah I repurposed these I forgot you know what I'm gonna do I've got a, a nice stock of light oil. Let's speed this process up just a tad. I can make another... Speed module. Speed module, speed module. There it is. Oh, it came to me. Cancel. There we go. You know what I'm going to do? Down this way. There. Out and out. There we go. They're all 
cranking away now. So how close are we? We've got to be close. I'm willing to go just a tad longer if it means that I can make this the last episode of the series. Woohoo! Okay. We are at 98%. Yes. Okay. I'm good. I'm good. What I need to do is I need to come over here. Somewhere around here. You need this. One raw fish. Okay. How close are we? We're at six. Come on, I can feel it. Seven, eight. Right there. Oh, it is so close. I need one more after this. So about twelve more. Twelve more rocket fuel. Where's where's my rocket fuel production? It's over there. Do I have... Nope, 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 nope. They're all being used. That's fine. Oh, so close. So, first things first. Let's run all the way over here. Nope, nope. Ha 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 ha! There it is! And let's put this rocket inventory! Put the satellite in! And launch! Lunch! Wow, this has taken a while. I severely. Look at it go! Ha <laughs> ha! Finally! Not bad. 25 hours, 33 minutes. And... Dead, dry, hairy treat one? What? Big worm five, tree, small spitter, medium. Yeah, just a whole bunch of junk. Ugh. 25 hours, 33 minutes. Uh, not not entirely bad. Um, I was actually spurred to finish this by, by Quill's playthrough because he did it in 24 hours and 33 minutes on his first try. Not too bad. But I'm going to do something else. Let's continue. I forgot to save. Let's see how far back we are. Save game. Now you're going to get to see... Uh, let's put this as 56. Good deal. And let's load a game. And let's see. This is... 20... 30... Okay. So, I got my achievement for launching a satellite. How close are we? 96. Right. I hadn't repurposed it yet. Come on. Let's run back. Nom, 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 nom. Yep, I hadn't repurposed these yet. go and okay so there goes all of that let's 
let's see. Can I repurpose these as well? Why not? I just want this. I want to launch again. in here. Really? I can't? I bet you I can. And, oop, nope. This one, I want to route up. There we go. I want to make sure that these are running non-stop. And if they are... Why did, thank you. There we go. So yeah, those are running non-stop. So I can actually put down two more. Where is my pole? There. So let's go take a look and see how far the rocket is now. And there's a reason why I'm doing this. I really should have. Oh, there it is. I didn't need to do all that. Let's get over here. Where is it? I mean, I grabbed it. Come here, fishy. And one raw fish launch. There it goes. <laughs> so long and thanks for all the fish. When you launch a fish into orbit, which is why I did that. Anyway, that's going to be it for this series. This was... Oh, this ending took a bit. I, Like I said, I seriously underestimated how much I needed for the rocket. Um, but it wasn't too bad. So, there's that at least. Uh, it's still kind of spaghettified, but decent decent, but I'm glad it's over. I'm glad I actually did this. So I hope you enjoyed the video and I hope you enjoyed the series. Thank you for watching and have fun.